In this lesson, we'll continue our review of Math Test 10. We're now on Section 4, Calculator Permitted. So this is the long section. And again, these questions are going to be pretty straightforward, especially in the beginning. So uh, just make sure you take advantage of them and work efficiently. All right, question one. A helicopter initially hovering 40 feet above the ground begins to gain altitude at a rate of 21 feet per second. Which of the following functions represents the helicopter's altitude? above the ground y in feet t seconds after the helicopter begins to gain altitude. So right away you should recognize this is a linear equation and think about linear equations typically are going to have like a fixed initial amount and then a variable route and uh, the flat rate the initial amount that's going to be the y-intercept and then the variable rate is the slope. So initially hovering at 40 feet right so that's what it the if you think about so initially let's say this is 40 feet right that's before it had begun to gain altitude before the slope even played into effect came into effect and so initially it was 40 and then it started gaining altitude at 21 feet per second and so sometimes they ask you to graph it i think the next question is like that but this one we just have to set up the equation and so y is the altitude so y we know the y-intercept is 40 and then the variable rate the slope it's going to be 21 feet per second so that's going to be 21t plus 40 and so the answer is b and then question two a text messaging plan i like how they uh, are using sort of like relevant topics on these test questions now <laughs> charges a flat fee of five dollars per month for up to 100 text messages plus sent plus 25 cents for each additional text message sent that much which of the following represents the cost y of sending the text sending x text in a month so here we know there's a flat rate of five dollars and so that is up until a hundred text messages and so here we've got to find the graph and let's just try and think about the graph before we look at the answer so we know it is going to be a flat rate and a hundred text messages so that is the x so here's a hundred well, I'm actually looking at A, which I think is the answer, right? So we know it's $5. It's going to be all the way a flat amount up to 100, and then it goes up, and this slope would be 0.25, right? So the answer here is A, and I'll just scroll down for these, and that's it for this page.